Builder General is a family business. We're in our fourth generation. Um, we sell lumber and building materials to uh, professional builders, remodelers, and uh, general contractors. We have seven locations. Um, we have approximately 170 employees right now, and we're just continuing to grow our locations as necessary. We've been in business since 1931. My grandfather started it. He was a local builder in Cranford, and he thought it would be a good idea to start his own supply company so he could supply himself and some of the other local builders in Cranford. And my father, along with uh, a couple of his brothers, joined, joined the company. We've expanded to where we are today. For 40 years I've been involved, we've seen recessions. We've seen building bubbles. We've seen building slumps. This little silver location where we're at today, which is our headquarters, uh, sat vacant for quite a few years because nobody wanted to be in the lumber business. But we had the foresight to uh, acquire it, knowing that the business would come back, and it did. You gotta persevere, you gotta drive, and, and, and have that passion. And, and, and if you do, that you can accomplish a lot and you can get through a lot. Ownership of this company obviously knows how to deal with the problems, with the good times and the bad times. If you have a culture that allows uh, that support behind you as a leader, um, you're going to be able to get through anything. It's gratifying to see that as a company we've survived. We have a very high retention level. We have some very long tenured employees and that speaks volumes to us. There was a gentleman who had worked here when my dad was here. He was here before my dad. If it's the right fit for them, they're here for good. Some of our top management right now started off as uh, stock boys or uh, yard laborers. We always look to promote from within. Um, you know the customers, you know the system, you know the environment, you know how we work. They're family, they're, they're friends, um, and they've been with us for a very long time. The family aspect of running the business doesn't ever seem to get lost in the business part of the business. The doors of the owners are always open um, to our customers and they know it. Our biggest um, attribute is the relationships that we create with our customers. We care what happens to them. We care how we service them. Our service goes above and beyond. Our customers expect it. Our customers know they're going to get it from us. Our reputation is, uh, is excellent. I would hear stories about my father um, giving people credit on a handshake. That's unheard of today. Multiple different people would come in and say, your father was the best. Your father, you know, when I was in trouble, your father let me $5,000. Just boom, like just, just like that. That, I think, resonated in all of our hearts. 100% is, is perfection, right? Um, I don't know if you ever can get there, but you gotta try real hard. And that's what we, we really aim to do here. I think the way that we try to achieve 100% satisfaction would be to listen to our customers, serve our customers, um, understand that without our customers, we are nothing. Without the customers, we wouldn't have a business. Builders General's been around for 90 years, and I would think and I would hope that we'll be around for another 90. We continue to acquire new locations, which helps us to grow and expand as a business. As long as we have great vendors, we have phenomenal customers and, and employees that just want to drive, we're going to make it and we're going to keep going one step at a time and it's going to be you know, a great great road. The future is, is not myself or my brother Phil. The future is the fourth generation and the fifth generation. That is the future. The nephews and the next generations or you know, however far down it goes, will learn from their predecessors and continue to run this business the way that it's been run, which is customer-oriented and customer-based. You hope that they retain and, and, and keep the same work ethic that we've tried to employ on them? I think we'd be surprised what they'll be able to do.